What's up, my peoples? MGO here, the freaking geek himself, and welcome to another exciting episode of MGO Build Stuff, the series where I, once again, rebuild something that I built yesterday. But hey, it's a thing, it's a thing we're gonna do. But, continuing on with the, uh, Nezha Transformers Windblade Kit, uh, we built the jet mode yesterday, so today we're gonna build the robot mode, so... Let's get down to it, because ain't nothing to it, but to do it. Let's just get started. And again, as always, I have the pieces all sorted out by step here, so I have everything I need as I need it, so I don't have to look for anything. And that just saves us all kinds of time, all kinds of time and energy and brain power that I do not have. So we're just going to get going and put this girl together. That's what we're going to do. We're going to put this girl together. So that's step one. Step two. Alrighty. So now, what are we doing here? We are doing this, and then this, and then this. Right? Yes. Yes. And then, what are we doing? This, it looks like. Okay. Alright. So that is, wait, okay, it's going, that's going here, okay. I already got a little confused there. I was like, what's happening? I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm on step two and I already got confused. Oh no, this is not gonna bode well. This is not gonna bode well at all. Step three, all right. <laughs> Oh no, I'm already confused with step three. That's never good. Is that supposed to go like that? Okay. Assuming that something else is, ah, okay. I see where we're going. I see where we're going. I'm already picking up what you are putting down. Okay. So this is going to go here and then all this is going to bridge across that and then this gets that tip there aha ah and you have a pen yay no, i wish that was the whole build but no we still got a ways to go we still have a ways to go all right moving on <laughs> moving right along so as usual how are you <laughs> how's your day as your quarantine, as usual, hope everybody's staying safe. So yeah, we just came from the grocery store. We did our essential shopping. So we went out, that was our outing. That was our outing for the week. You know, this is what we do now. Went to the grocery store, got our essentials, our essential things of essentialness. And then came home, put the groceries away, and then I washed my hands vigorously for 20 minutes. Is that right, 20 minutes? That's how long you're supposed to do it, right? 20 minutes? You're supposed to sing the score from the first act of Les Mis while you're doing it? That's right, right? That's what I heard. I, I, I might be doing it wrong. I might be overdoing it. I don't know. My hands are so dry. Is I think I'm doing it wrong, actually. I think I'm not. Well, yeah, well, whatever. Whatever. It's okay. But, you know, it is what it is. Okay, so what are we doing here? Boom. We are. <laughs> oh, man. Anyway. I sing the score to Les Mis anyway, so really, it's, that doesn't change much. And uh, that part of my lifestyle has not changed at all, really. But, you know, I just, hey. I usually, I, I don't do musicals, but dang it, Les Mis was a good movie. <laughs> I actually enjoyed that. Hugh Jackman and Hathaway. I thought they did their thing, man. I was impressed. That was all done live, too. They sang all that live. That's impressive. They had to get up at, like, you know, 4 o'clock in the morning and sing live. That's like... Anyway. Let's not talk about Les Mis. <laughs> this is going to be... <laughs> Yesterday we are talking about bidets and buttholes. Today we're going to talk about Les Mis. That's what we're going to do. No, that's not... Actually, speaking of buttholes, let's let's talk more about what happened. <laughs> I can already hear people like, let's not, let's not, let's not do that again. Let's just not, please, sir, please not. 
I'm sorry. I won't. I will not talk about you know my bowel movements anymore. Let's talk about yours. How are yours coming out? They're coming out good. Are you regular? I hope so. It's good to be regular. It's one of the few things in my life that are regular nowadays. To be perfectly honest, or, you know. But it's hey, we gotta, we gotta, we just gotta, you know, we gotta cling to what we can. We have to take any small victories we can get at this point in time, you know. Even if it's just you know pooping on a regular basis, that's it's just something. Hey, it's a victory. It's a small victory. Something we can be proud of. Are you, is there enough fiber in your diet? I hope so. I hope you're keeping yourself nice and fibered. You know, again, keep you regular. It's a th I, what? I'm not making this up. It's science, man. It's all just science. I don't make the rules. I just break them. <laughs> anyway, so uh, that's going here. That bridges all that. Okay. We're going places. We're going places and doing things. And again, things are going pretty smoothly so far. I know at some point I'll mess something up because that's just what always happens because I'm going, you know, I'm, I'm rushing here. I don't know why you guys are only going to watch like seven minutes of this video anyway, so it doesn't really matter how long it is, but you yeah, know, hey, we'll just go with the flow. <laughs> We'll just go with the flow. All right. So right now we're building Windblade's body here, obviously. The body, the body, the body. Anyway. <laughs> Do you remember that episode of Mr. Bean? Did anybody here watch Mr. Bean? Please don't tell me I'm the only one. That episode where he went to the school and he's like in the art class and he had to draw the naked lady. The teacher's all like, throw the body, the body, the body. And, you know, he's being all bashful and like, oh, you know. Uh, it's one of my favorites. One of my favorite episodes. But anyway. <laughs> I love Mr. Bean. He's amusing. I came up watching Mr. Bean and the Three Stooges. I mean, the Three Stooges are like way before my time. I'm not that old. You know, Three Stooges are way before my time, but I love the Three Stooges. And I actually still watch them on uh, on MeTV. I don't know if that's a station that... but I don't know if that's just a Philadelphia station. Um, yeah, there's a station here called MeTV, and they just play like a lot of old TV shows and movies. And um, like every Saturday, every Saturday night, they play a bunch of Three Stooges shorts and i will sit there and watch them and still laugh because they're just they're just they're just funny they're just funny even though those those, those you know shorts were shot like in the 40s they're still funny dang it they're still some funny dudes just good old slapstick comedy at its best they don't do slapstick comedy like that anymore they just don't Now they would call that abuse. <laughs> if the Three Stooges actually happened today, if that show actually happened now, that would be called like abuse, and people would be calling into the network to have it, you know, have the show canceled and shut down. Cause what is it teaching our children, our children, and their fragile little minds? Oh God! Like, let's not talk about what we used to watch as kids. Like, if you're if you're my age. I'm 40 years old, by the way. If you're my age, do you remember the cartoons we used to watch? Oh my god. If those cartoons came out today, parents would lose their minds. Parents would just, they would, again, they would be like calling into the networks and writing angry, you know, tweets and trying to have it shut down. Like, you know, like I remember <laughs> as much as people talk about violence in, 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 you know, in entertainment nowadays, I mean, keep in mind, like, back in the day, I used to watch, you know, Bugs Bunny cartoons, and, you know, like, Elmer Fudd would shoot Daffy Duck, point blank, in the face, with a shotgun. Nobody complained. We laughed our butts off. We thought it was funny. <laughs> but now... And, oh, now I messed something up already. But now... If that happened, people would lose their ever-loving minds and be like, no, 
Think about the children. You're ruining them. You're ruining the children's brains. Uh, just had that one step up. See, I already messed something up. See, I knew it was going to happen eventually. I was going to mess something up. There we go. It's all Bugs Bunny's fault. All Bugs Bunny and Elmer Fudd's fault. And Daffy Duck. All three of them. They distracted me. All three of them distracted me. All right. There we go. <laughs> But it's the truth, though. Am I lying? Am I lying? I'm not lying. If that kind of cartoon came out today, I mean, granted, I mean, I mean, granted, like cartoons today are still very like they're 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 whew, they're out there. Um, make sure I'm putting this in the right spot. Yes. I mean, cartoons today are you know like I mean, you watch Family Guy. If you watch Family Guy, like that's no holds barred. Like. Which is hilarious, and I'm genuinely amazed that Family Guy is still on the air, as, you know, because they just, like I said, no holds barred, they just do and say whatever, <laughs> and they make the most racist jokes and stuff like that. I'm genuinely surprised that that show has not been taken off the air due to a bunch of, you know, angry people on the internet complaining about it. Genuinely amazed. But there are still some parents that like complain about that stuff. Whoops. But yeah, like, you know, I mean, you know, there, there are cartoons today that are just as like, ooh, that's, that's, that's not for children. <laughs> that is not made for kids. <laughs> you know? Definitely are. But not as much. They're, they're the cops. I don't know if you can hear the sirens. The cops are, I said the cops are like, no, we're shutting... We're shutting this conversation down. We're shutting this conversation down. It's not good for the children to hear. They can't hear this kind of conversation. What will happen to their fragile little minds? All right, we're getting one blade together. Smoothly, efficiently. Only one little hiccup so far. And we have a little Autobot symbol blocked right there. She gets her, she gets her brand right here. Oops, wrong way. Boop. And boop. And what's going on here? That is. That goes. Okay. I'm just making her. Uh, we're making her belly. We're making her belly. Making her abs. Her Brazilian robo ab muscles. There we go. Alright. So now what are we doing here? I don't know. Uh, we're doing this right here. So my steps I have put a little too close together, so I'm trying to remember what step is what step. Okay. Uh, and may I just say, this took a long time to get all this set up for today. Oh my god. I was... I think in total it took... I think it took like... Over two hours to take, take, take the jet mode apart. And then... Um, take the jet mode apart... And then, like, reorganize all these pieces step by step. And I actually did uh, did a little something to save myself some time today. And I'll show you what that is in a little bit. So we are here now. So, you know, trying to be as time efficient as I can be. Uh, you know, one thing I really like about these sets is that they managed to make the modes look really clean. Like, there's not a whole lot of exposed studs. Like, I, I really like that. I really appreciate that. Like, it just makes them look super clean. You know, I mean, I don't mind the exposed, the exposed studs. But, uh... That's where her head is going to go. Oop. I, mean, I don't mind the exposed studs, because, again, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a Lego-esque you know, kit, so obviously that's kind of the point. You're going to see them, but, um, I still find it quite, quite cool that they managed to, you know, kind of keep this as clean as possible. Oh, we're making a collar here. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at this. This is, oh, I like this. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at it. Look, isn't that nice? Look at that. That's pretty cool right there. That's nifty. 
That's a nifty thing right there. Okay, let me shut up and concentrate on the build here. We're trying not to have this last all day. Okay. Boom. Oh, this is working out nicely. These are little shoulder spikes. Little shoulder spikes. All right. <laughs> All right, and she gets a uh, she gets a little little crutch piece right there. <laughs> you know what's funny when you look at Windblade, you you basically realize like the way her colors are laid out. That Windblade is basically just wearing like a small red top and red panties, and that's really what she, that's really what's happening there. <laughs> that is really genuinely what's happening with Windblade. I mean, look at the way her colors are laid out. She's just wearing a little red top of panties. The red panties. That's it. She's basically in her underwear. She's in her like robo underwear. When you actually look at it, it's like, oh, wow. Well, hmm. So where is this going? That is going into the central portion. So that's going right in the middle. Okay, so now we are building a okay, we're building a thigh. We're building her thigh. My, my. Oh, my. Okay. Uh. So I'm glad everyone uh, enjoyed my little, uh, my little story about the bidet. Okay, <laughs> not everybody enjoyed it. <laughs> Some people were like, what am I listening to? What's happening here? One person in particular was like, I was not ready for this discussion. Like, <laughs> I was not prepared for this discussion. And you know what? You know what? All I have to say is, uh, you know, nor was I. Nor was I. But one day, a bidet will rise from our ranks and use the power of the water to wash our darkest orifice. Oh, what's, what's happening? Again, what's happening? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Hey, hey. Again, what's, what's happening here? <sighs> Whatever. That's what's happening here because that's what I do. That's what happens on this channel. Whatever. That's exactly what happens here. There are no rules. The only rules is there are no rules on this channel. If you can't handle that, well, that's just, you're too bad. But, you know. <laughs> so, how are you? <laughs> How's your day? <laughs> I know I did all this already. But anyway. I feel like I am... Okay. Okay, I'm not missing anything. I was just... Okay. I had to just turn the piece around. So that goes there. And this goes here. And this goes here. Boop. And that goes here. Ah. Boop. And there we go. And we have... A thigh and this goes on like this that's on this side just snap into a slim gym boom like that so what I did to save myself some time is I did the second verse same as the first already I built it last night so there we go we had the other thigh there we go so it took a lot of extra time last night but it's gonna save me time today so yay yay for saving time so I've already done all these steps thighs already put together so now we are Jumping back at this point. So, what are we doing here? So now we're building her her lower legs. That's right. That's right. Here they go the cops again. Oh my god. <laughs> you have no idea how often I will hear sirens in this neighborhood. Like I don't live in a bad neighborhood. I really don't. Like this is actually a pretty quiet neighborhood. But I love how step 44 is literally just one brick. Just one piece. This is not a brick, I know, but it's just, like, step 44 is one piece. Like, really, you couldn't just lump it into step 43. This had to be its own step. There you go. That's step 44. Done. Makes no sense. Makes no sense. You nezha, people. Again, I know that's not how you pronounce that. I just, you know, again, I just, I just say it that way for my own amusement because, you know... I say things in weird ways. That's what I do. That's my thing. That's my thing that I do. Because it brings me amusement. Amusement in amusing ways. So there we go. 
So now we are here. <sighs> so we're getting through this pretty quickly, pretty efficiently, and it'll be a matter of time before I majorly mess something up. I'm sure, but hey. Alright. So we're here, and now we're here. So... Ah, there was something else I wanted to talk about, and it's completely just escaped my brain. What was I about to talk about? Tell me. What was I about to talk about? Is it about my bowel movements again? Is that what I was going to talk about? I think that was... was no, that's not what I was going to talk about. So, <laughs> people were like, please no. Please, dear God, no. <laughs> not again. Not again. Uh, what? What? I was about to talk about something and I completely forget what it was. I really, I really don't remember what I was going to say. I had something right on tap and it just whoop, escaped my brain. Escaped my brain pan. What the heck was I talking about? All I know is I heard the police and I was like, I didn't do it. I didn't do it. Just a natural reflex. I don't know why. I didn't do it. I obey the law. I didn't do anything. I just went outside today to do my grocery shopping. That's all I did. That's all I did. I didn't do anything else wrong. Right. Okay, so this is going... Actually, let me put these pieces on first. Wait, let me put this piece on first. Just so I'm kind of sure of where everything else is supposed to go. It's funny because I already built this leg, well, the other side of this leg. And I'm still a bit confused. Okay, so all that goes like that. Okay. Okay, we're cool. We're cool. We're cool. Alright, so that goes across that. And that goes like that. Boom. Shake, shake, shake the room. Okay. Alrighty, we are making some nice progress, and I like progress. It's moving along swimmingly. Swimmingly, I say! Oh, yes. Oh, yes! That goes up top like that. And that goes here. Go. Go to your home. Go to your home. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That goes there. And there we go. And we're almost done with this, and then we get these right here. And then she gets a little spike. She gets a little spike on the back of her leg. Like that. Boop. There you go. And then we're here. And this goes like what? Like what? Like this. Like this. And like that. And that goes here. And that's her. Oops. And that's her knee. And that is a lower leg. And that gets snapped into a slim gym. And again, the second verse, just like the first, has already been completed. So we can just snap this on. And here we go. Efficiency. Efficiency is my game now. There we go. We're doing things. We're doing things right. So, now what are we doing? We are now making uh, feet. We're making our feet. Our feeties. Our big old feeties. Ooh. Ooh. Why are the neighbors so loud? Jeez. Jeez, man. Neighbor. <laughs> I don't know if you... You probably can't hear it. And the neighbors are like... Keep opening and closing their door. And you can hear them like... Like stomping around over there. I don't know what they're doing. What are they doing? I don't know what they're doing. I don't know. I don't know what they're doing. All I know is they're doing it on my time. Don't they know when I'm recording they have to sit perfectly still in their house? And not make a single bit of noise. Don't they know these things? Did I not send them a memo? I did. I sent them a memo. Apparently they're ignoring it. 
some people, some people. Anyway. Okay, so we got toes on. And where are we now? So we are turning this around and we are doing what? We are doing this. Okay. I've already done all this, but I have to do it again. Okay, boom. And doing the same thing here. Boom. Boom, I feel a sneeze coming on. I may have to sneeze. I may have to sneeze. Did I? Mm. Mm. Uh, no, I think it went away. Okay, it went away. Okay. Whew. It went away. It's all good. It's okay. It's okay. Sorry. I didn't sneeze. It went away. Okay. Even her toe. This little panel there. Make the toe nice and clean. Isn't that lovely? That is just lovely. I got these right here. Boom. And that's a foot. And that is a foot. That snaps. Ah! That wasn't supposed to happen. <laughs> that wasn't supposed to happen at all. Wait, where am I? How did this go? Okay. <laughs> How dare you? How dare you when I was trying to snap into a Slim Jim? There we go. So again, second verse. Just like the first. There you go. Now she has two feet. Ready for feet. You don't come apart on me. There we go. Now she has feet. Now she can be mobile. Yay! Now she can stand. Hooray. Hooray for standing. You stand over there. Because I ain't done with you yet. You stand there and you wait your turn. Little lady. Alright. So now we're going to start building her wings. Her wingies. That goes right there. Boom. And then uh, we turn this around. And that goes a boom. Right? Yes. Boom. <laughs> boom. Then we are here. We're actually getting through this pretty quickly, I think. I don't know. I haven't checked the time yet. Because I'm on such a roll here. I'm trying not to waste any moments. Any moments, any precious moments that you're going to skip through. I can't waste these precious moments that you'll never experience because you're skipping through the video. We can't waste these precious moments because <laughs> they're so precious. So, so precious. Uh, okay. Got this right? Yes. All right. Where are we? Where are we? We are here. I hope I'm doing this right. Yes, I am. Okay. Again, I've done this before because I've already built the other side, but I always, I always feel like I have to double check just to be sure. Because again, I do always manage to mess something up. But we're building Windblade's wings. Okay, where am I? I'm here, 72. We're on step 72, by the way. In case you want to keep track of the steppage, the steppage. We're on step 72. That's right, this has a lot of steps. The robot mode always has way more steps than the vehicle mode. Although her jet mode did have quite a few steps also. Her jet mode was, I think, 69 steps. This is well over 100 steps. Put wind blade together. Wind burrito. So what are we doing here? We are going. Boom. And nobody told me the name of this piece, by the way. Nobody told me what this is called. I asked in the last video. What is the name of this piece? Does it have a name? And nobody's answered me. Come on. Come on. I thought you guys were experts. I thought you guys knew everything. I thought you guys were so smart and know everything. But you can't answer that question, huh? Okay, I see. I see. I see. Where am I going? Am I in the right spot? See, I know I'm not smart because I mess everything up. There we go, okay. So, on the contrary, me, I know I'm not smart because I mess things up. Look at that, I almost messed up, for example. But I'm okay, I recovered. 
I recovered. You know why? Because I'm smart. I'm not smart, really. I try to be. I try to be, but most of the time I fail miserably at being intelligent. I don't know. It's just a... It's a gift. Or a curse. However you want to look at it. Get in there. There we go. This goes... Ooh, we doing it. We doing it. I, re I really don't want to check the time here because I just, I just, I'm on such a good roll right now. I don't even want to know how long I've been doing this. I'm, I'm just, I'm just, I'm rocking and rolling here. Rocking and rolling, strutting and strolling. I don't want to, I don't want to break my momentum here. I really don't. Even to take two seconds to, to, to check the time because right now I'm very proud of myself I feel like I, I haven't really done any major mess ups I've done like one little minor one but that's it or two minor ones either way not a whole lot of mess ups so I'm pleased <laughs> I don't know about you I'm pleased okay so we get the little fan little fan deal that's what I call it the fan deal and that goes there, and boom, get, get on there, go to your home, go to your home, there you go, there we go, and we have a wing, yay, so, uh, which side does this go on, this is on this side, so pop on a wing, yay, and of course, the second verse, just like the first, we already did it, and we're going to pop on for the wing, you can't see what I'm doing, Ooh, there we go. And she has both of her wings. Yay! All right. Okay. So, where are we going? Oh, I feel a sneeze coming on again. Oh! Oh, no. Oh, don't do it. Don't do it. <sniffs> ah! Okay. Sorry, I try to fight off sneezes. I try not to sneeze on camera. Uh, okay, where am I? Where, where, what am I doing? Oh, that's okay. I'm starting off. I started off on the wrong spot there. I'm not here. I am here. This is where we are. This is where we live. Right here. Okay. So we're doing that. And then we are doing this. So yeah, so now we are building her arms. This is the arm build right here. An armature, if you will. <laughs> I know that's not funny. I know. Okay, so we are doing that, right? Yes. Okay. Can you see what I'm doing? Okay. Can you see what I'm doing? Can you see me? Can you hear me? Can you hear me out there, peoples? Can you hear me? Right. We're on the home stretch. We're on the last row of pieces here. I am pleased. I am so very pleased with my progress and my efficiency. This is great. This is great. I'm, I'm dead serious. I'm very happy right now that this has gone so smoothly. You have no idea. I am genuinely, I feel a genuine sense of accomplishment and pride right now that I've gotten through this so smoothly. Okay, so that's her forearm. And now we're going to build her upper arm. But now I'm dead serious. I feel quite proud of myself right now. This has gone off with barely a hitch. Barely a hitch. All right. So we are doing this. And that goes, oops. Boom. Boom. This is our upper arm we're building right now. And then, what are we doing? We're doing this right here. Oh, here's a cool little little bit right here. I personally really like this. A little flat panel here, and then you have these two little little pieces right here, and that just fills all that out very nicely. I like that. This, again, 
It's simple, but it's effective, but it works. Sometimes there is genius in simplicity. I always say that. Sometimes there is genius in simplicity. Sometimes when you try to make it too complicated, you end up ruining it. Sometimes there is genius in simplicity. And there you go. And that is her form. And that will go where? Wait. What are we doing here? This is boom, 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 boom. There we go. Boom. So there's her arm. And the last thing to build is her hand. I just get that. And boom. Oops. You go to your home. Boom. And boom. Now she needs her fingers. Her little fingies. Oops. Oops. Hey, oops. Like that. And that goes on. Boom. And of course, again, I already built her other arm, so she has two arms. Hurry for arms. And now we can rise. Yes. Now we can bring Windblade in and we can pop our arms on. There we go. And there we go. And last but not least is her head. Yay! Get that on there. There go the cops again. Oh no. <laughs> and there you go. There you have Windblade. Yay! We're all done. Copyright Hasbro. Okay. There you go. There is... There's Windblade. I gotta get her kind of straightened out here. Her wings are a little heavy for these joints. Whoops. I will say that. Her wings are a little bit... They seem like they're a bit too heavy for these, uh, for these ball joints that they're on. And that piece just came off. How did this go on? Like that. I guess they're supposed to kind of rest in a specific spot so they just don't kind of... Like that, maybe? I don't know. But, yeah. There you go. There's one blade. <laughs> She's a little awkward looking, but, you yeah, know. Hey, for what it is. Hey. It works. It works out pretty well, but, yeah, I think those... There we go. We can get the wings off a little bit more. There you go. It's all right. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Again, for what it is, I think it works out pretty well. Not too bad. Got a little spikes back here and all that. We'll get her on the turntable later, but yeah. Not too shabby. One thing to point out too, I got hold up, I got I gotta take her head off again because I gotta show you this. Whoever painted her head like splotched the back of it. Look at that. That is just like I don't know who painted this head, but geez, they just were kinda I don't know what happened there. That's some sloppy work there. The front looks fine, but the back what the uh, anyway. It's okay. It is what it is. It's all right. It's all right. There you go. There's Wimbley. And just for a comparison, here it is with the Warrior Class Cyberverse Windblade. And here it is with the Nes Ha Rhyme. Let's see how that works out. Yay! She's as big as Prime. So, <laughs> there you go. So there you have the robot mode for Windblade, and yes, this was an enjoyable build. We got through it quickly and efficiently, and that makes me very happy. Oh no, it looks pretty good for what it is. Um, one thing to note about these kits that I've noticed is that the ball joint connections are a bit on the loose side. So posing them is it's not really happening because it seems like the limbs are a little too heavy. They're a little heavier than the joints can uh, than the ball joints can actually you know, the handle, but you know, there are ways to fix it, obviously, but as is, yeah, the ball joints are a bit on the loose side, so that's a thing, but all in all, though, um, for what they are, I mean, they look pretty good, they're fun to put together, so, you know, all in all, not too shabby, a little bit of room, a room for, bleh, this is where my tongue stops working, a bit of room for improvement as far as those ball joint connections go, but all in all, these are still pretty enjoyable, so. There you go. Now I picked these up from Sir Toys. I'll put a link to their site in the description 
down below so you can check that out. For all your other Transformers needs, there's always BigBadToyStore.com, also linked in the description down below so you can check that out as well. You can also check out the MGO Build Stuff playlists for all of those other builds that you probably haven't watched all of, but whatever it is what it is, but it's linked in the description down below. So again, things, stuff, description, you know how it works. So, as always, this is MGO saying, remember, you don't stop playing because you grow old. You grow old because you stop playing. Be a geek. Be proud. Boom in your face.